I am truly happy to be the Member of Parliament for Grosley standing here today as we honor a true servant of the people of Grosley, Honorable Julian Alha. And I can say this without any fear of contradiction, no one can make a logical argument for this stretch of road being named after anyone more deserving. It is therefore my hope that the new name of the Sir Julian Hunt Highway, commencing from this shock roundabout through the western corridor of the constituency of the town of Grosley, to the town of Grosley, which he represented with distinction in Parliament, will bring to the fore his foresight, hard work, commitment, friendship, and benevolence on our sporting, cultural, and political life. And I remember Julian Hunt single-handedly building playing fields, single-handedly building community centers, single-handedly building roads from his pocket for the people of Grosely. that I come here today to accept this recognition of the Groselay chapter of my journey in public life. As some of you may know, this journey began in the 1960s when I became a member of the JC's organization and around the same time a councillor on the Castry City Council. And it progressed from there to Groselay, the constituency I represented in Parliament for 10 years from 1987. That period of working for the people of Groselay has been one of the most rewarding of my life. It was a period of wholeheartedly giving service and assistance to all in Groselay, the mothers and fathers groups, the sportsmen and sportswomen in Grand Rivier, Moshi and Groselay town, the fisher folk, the farmers, the vendors and business people. It was a period of forming friendships that have not withered away with time. It was a period of witnessing the growth of Groselay from a new town in 1985 to the major tourism centre of the island by turn of the century. It was an honour to have played a role in the development of the constituency. And I learned that in giving unflinchingly to your fellow man, one does indeed receive, as the good book says. I want to take this opportunity to thank all those in Groselay who had supported me in the decade and a half working for the people of Groselay. If the support of the family who formed the JR group of companies was essential to my ability to represent Groselay and lead a very active public life, then the support of my personal family, my, my wife and my children, were vital for my life of public service, whether it was in politics, in cricket, diplomacy and business. Ladies and gentlemen, it is indeed pleasing to see that my contribution to Groselay and St. Lucia has been honoured, and as is also commonly said, that I have received my flowers now. Once more, it is with deep humility that I accept this high honour bestowed on me, and I thank all who made it possible, and all who accompanied me on the journey that brought me here today. Thank you.